Sanjeeva is back from his shot. He just did a shot, uh, almost looking like a college scene, right outside Girls College <laughs> in Karamuni. And That's true, yeah. I've just changed the outfit of, also. <laughs> oh, yes. And there was a lot of crowd uh, just there, uh, waiting to get a glimpse of you. This movie, from what I saw, from the scene I saw just now, was mm -hmm. a completely commercial movie. Yeah, commercially, I mean, uh, more of uh, youngster films mm -hmm. and see, the thing is, this particular film which I'm doing, Singampuli, mm -hmm. so it has like uh, all kinds of genres, I can tell mm -hmm. you, like it has commercial, masala, mm -hmm. anything you say. And it has Shantanu to give you the comedy bit. Yes, uh, we have uh, Santanam, very Santanam. true. So Santanam is a, like, you know, we uh, did this film called Siba Manasla Shakti, mm -hmm. our combo really worked very well. It did. But after that, now we are just um, teaming up in this film. Mm, we are doing some good, uh, super cool comedy scenes and all that stuff. So I think uh, things are working out pretty you good. You say super cool very mm. often. No? Now, the uh -huh. question I was trying to ask you, uh, mm. Jeeva, is the fact that, you know, when Ram came out a few years ago, 2005, if I'm not wrong, mm -hmm. uh, the industry took notice of you and uh, the audiences took notice of you as one uh, niche actor who perhaps would fit into that um, art cinema category and soon after that there was a host of movies like E and all other commercial movies. See, I, I, I could, I, I, uh, I don't know, I don't know the term of art mm. and uh, I always see it as a film. I don't see it as an art film, offbeat film, commercial film, masala film, Thriller, uh, middle comedy, film okay. or uh, all that stuff you know. Mm. I see this film, I see every film as its own genre, it has its own genre, it has its own, I trip on, a diff see, I, I, people, a lot of people ask me, uh, you only do different films, you trip on only, are you kind of, um, you know, what's happening with you, are you, because you did this Katra Tamil Ram, you're doing all this autistic roles and little psychedelic roles and all that stuff. I see, see, that's what, you know, people try to brand me at that point of view. So that film, to break all that image, I did a film called Tanavat, I did a film called Siva Manasla Shakti, I did a film called E, which had everything. See, a lot of people ask me, um, uh, how do you differentiate art film, commercial film and all that stuff. I was like totally, uh, I was not, I, I, I didn't understand the question actually. So, I said every film is important for me. I said, but what did it do to you when Ram came? For instance, did you see yourself as someone who had arrived in the ma in mainstream cinema? Because Ram was a different movie. It was a huge experiment. Of course, it had Amir who, who was who had tried his hands, yeah. and it did so well in uh, the. Very true. Very true. Festivals. See, as you said, uh, Ram actually recognized me. Did the you think it was a risk at that point? No, that for me at that point of time it was a survival, mm -hmm. because. Uh, so the first two films which we had uh, produced in our own banner. So it was like more of uh, uh, a family film and another one is like more of a little uh, commercial film, everything youthful film and all this stuff. It actually didn't work out. Uh, but then at that point of time, see when you try to sell a product, so you try to scream and sell it. So what I did is when you do something very different, very loud. So I felt uh, Ram was a little loud. I, I felt doing an autistic role, doing a risky role, uh, it was actually loud for me. Uh, when even Ra, Mr. Amir, uh, the film's director, I should actually thank him through this program for giving me such a great break. But even for him, it was also a, a survival part because he did a film called Maunam Pesiyade. It was, uh, critically, it was very good. It was, uh, I mean, uh, a lot of critics said it, it's a very good film, but uh, it's an offbeat film, so it didn't... Uh, uh, hit the box office and all that stuff, but uh, for um, Mr. Amir to prove that how good as a director he is, so he had to give had a to film called Ram. Like Ram. So when he told me the first uh, first shot said, I mean, of the film, because it's a big uh, sequence in that film, it's like more of uh, you know I coming up and I, I lie down as a dead body and yes, then. Yes, yes, I, I remember the so, shot. Oh, so that was whole shot, he, he yeah, house. yeah, he Where explained. Was that shot? Was it it, it was in Kodai, it was shot in Kodai. Mm. So it was like more of, we, we shot this film uh, totally in Kodai. So he told me this whole sequence. When he, actually when he told me this whole sequence, I was like to totally thrilled and amazed and I was like, yes, I'm going to do this film. And it was like, let's wrap, you know, let's, let's, uh, let's hit, started. yeah, let's mm. roll it. Mm. So then again, you know, I was a uh, reckoning actor, I had, uh, uh, like uh, there was no producers coming out for uh, films like this, mm. offbeat films, you know, people actually think twice. So it was little, people were thinking twice to do that. Then uh, Amir himself produced this film, 
and we really gave a you know big shot and it was like probably you didn't it took think at any point in no. time you should take your father's help no 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 because uh, my dad himself asked uh, can we do this film in our own manner then uh, amir said no sir i this film is my responsibility that, yes. i will do yeah it it can be changed mm. so i i would be really uh, uh, like you know it would be really prestigious for me to do this film mm. in my own manner so mm. he actually took up this project mm. and he did this and it was like more of uh, a great success and uh, it was all over the world it was recognized and every yes. person still when i go to somewhere uh, in america or somewhere in uh, kumbakonam oh, yes. somewhere in some down south i go people recognize me as ram first and then jeeva right. then you know it's, it's something like that so i was like very much i should actually thank him through this program super so that's a big thank you to amir and uh, i'll thank you too for this particular segment but you come back because there's a lot more about jeeva that i know that i want to just check with him because i think from what the feedback i got was that jeeva consciously make, makes this attempt to be friendly with the uh, uh the other stars mainly uh the lead roles that actors play and if there is any truth in that or not we'll know after this